As the threat landscape continues to evolve, email remains the number one most popular source of attacks on businesses by hackers. Using MDAM and email server for your business provides affordable security from email threats. However, the software version is key to understanding your risk exposure. Did you realize that if you or your customer is running MDAM and email server version 21 or older, there are over 300 new security and performance features you are missing compared to the newest release of version 22? To protect against the ever-changing email threat landscape, it's important to understand some key features your older version of MDAMON may be missing. In MDAMON 18, we introduced mailbox scanning for MDAMON antivirus, which allows administrators to configure a schedule to scan all mailboxes at regular intervals. This allows the detection of any infected messages that may have passed through before existing antivirus applications were updated. We also added email encryption options via the Compose window in MDAM and Webmail, allowing users to easily protect messages containing sensitive information from getting into the wrong hands. And we introduced enhanced security to protect users from being redirected to malicious websites that are used to collect personal data. In MDAM 19, we introduced an external message header to alert users when a message they've received came from outside of their organization. This provides extra protection against phishing by helping users identify suspicious emails that employ various techniques to try to appear legitimate. We also added authentication failure and frozen account reports for MDAMON's dynamic screening feature to alert administrators and end users when suspicious login activity has been detected so that corrective action can be taken. And we introduced macro detection in MDAMON antivirus. Phishing emails often employ social engineering to try to trick email recipients into opening Microsoft Word documents that contain malicious code. This can lead to an influx of malware on your network and even data breaches. Macro detection in MDAMON antivirus helps prevent these dangerous attachments from ever reaching your end users. In MDAMON 20, we introduced the ability to check for compromised passwords that your users are attempting to use. This feature identifies passwords against a list of credentials that have been exposed in data breaches. Hackers often use published passwords to attack mail servers. This feature prevents users from using those passwords for their MDAMON accounts. We improved message encryption by adding support for Require TLS and MTA STS, which are security standards used to ensure email is sent securely over an encrypted connection. This helps prevent unauthorized message tampering while ensuring privacy and data integrity. And support for multi-server clustering to help protect against email service interruptions. In MDAMON 21, we introduced system-generated application passwords, which provide greater security and protection against hackers by allowing users to use a different password for each mail client or device that they use to access their email. We also added blocked connection reports for dynamic and IP screening to help administrators review the effectiveness of their security policies. And we added password strength meters for MDM and WebL and remote administration to encourage users to use stronger passwords. And in MDM and 22, we introduced the Siren Global View Cloud Service for MDM and Antivirus. As malware threats alter their behavior in many ways to avoid detection by traditional antivirus, a new level of sophisticated analysis is needed to protect against these threats. The Siren Global View Security Cloud processes over 25 billion transactions a day and blocks over 300 million threats a day across multiple detection vectors, providing real-time protection against the latest threats without adversely affecting performance. To help promote the use of strong passwords, we added a list of password requirements that displays green and checked off as the user meets the requirements when entering a new password. And we added support for the latest security protocol used to encrypt connections on newer versions of Windows. Our goal is to ensure that you are using the latest security features to protect your company and users from the changing email threat landscape. We hope this information helps you make an informed choice about the best email security approach for your organization. To verify the current version of your MDAMON software, log into MDAMON Remote Administration and click on the About link in the upper right-hand corner. You'll find the MDAMON version right here at the top. To check the license status of your MDAMON software, click on the Registration button. This section will show you whether your license is current or expired. And while you're here, you can also check the registration status for MDAMON Antivirus, MDAMON Connector, and ActiveSync. If your license is current but you are on an older version, you can upgrade to the latest version of MDAMON for free. However, if your license has expired, you can still upgrade at a discount over the new pricing. 
If you purchase Dim Damon through our global network of resellers, please contact your local Lim Damon reseller to upgrade or renew M Damon. Visit our purchasing page at mdamon.com and enter your license key to verify pricing for the newest version of M Damon and to protect your company from the latest email threats.